YouTube, it's Miranda, and tonight I am going on a little fancy date night with Jordan. Ugh, I just went upstairs for my hairbrush, and what did I not get? My hairbrush. Never fails. Anyway, I actually already did my hair earlier, but I just wanted to touch it up a little bit. Um, some spots that like weren't perfectly smooth. Then I'm gonna put some makeup on and put on kind of a fancy outfit because we're going to this place called Cava. It's, I think it's an Italian restaurant, but they have like a rooftop area and like topiaries and I think it's really cute. I saw this girl I know posted um, pictures there and I was like, I need to try it. So it's about an hour away, but it sounds like it's gonna be worth it. And Jordan's on vacation this week, so just a little fun date night thing to do. So yeah, I'm just gonna get ready, finish my hair, touch it up, and then put on some makeup, and then I will show you guys my outfit. Okay, my makeup is done and my outfit is on. I'm gonna show it to you in the mirror. So this is my outfit. The skirt keeps coming up, but I want my like skin to show right here. I just like how that looks, but this is the full outfit, these cute little heels. Um, this is from a store close to me called Eblins. Um, it's just like a basic black bandeau top, except I had to fold this under because otherwise it's a little too long. So I just fold it up a little bit. And this skirt is from Target, and I don't think I've ever owned a skirt like this, ever. And the shoes are also from Target, and they're actually so comfortable. I love how they're just like super simple with a little heel. So cute, I love my outfit so much, and it's like comfortable, I feel good in it, and that is very important, because especially at a place that you know you're gonna wanna take pictures at, you have to feel good, and I feel good. I like this outfit a lot. One thing I didn't think through was my animal print purse with my animal print skirt, but but we can get over it, right? <laughs> I love this purse, also from Target. Ready, babe? Ready. All right, now we're gonna drive. It's like an hour drive, so probably gonna listen to folklore for an hour. Sounds good, right? Woo! We ordered some appetizers. The lighting is impeccable. <laughs> Jordan went to grab the food and then saw me take out the camera and <laughs> fold his hand away. So this is the Capri salad, pretty standard. And then this is the, what? how many cheeses was it? Six. Six cheese garlic bread. I know, right? It looks really good. Let's see. Thoughts on the bread? It was really good. And this was really good too. Don't worry, I won't leave that on the plate. Okay, our food's here. He got chicken parmesan and I got lobster ravioli. I'm so excited. Yum. And somehow we fell for a dessert, even though we're so full. <laughs> it was you. <laughs> she brought like a huge tray of all the desserts and it caught him. It'll be worth it. I don't have a bite yet. You tried different parts. Mm. I think it was a good choice. If it has Oreos in the name, then Jordan sold. <laughs> if you're wondering how much our fancy dinner costs, there is the grand total. But it was just really good. And I sometimes think that it's hard to impress me. Like, if it's a $26 meal, then it better be like really good. And this was really good. I really, really liked it. Which we can get over it. Should okay. I put it in a Yelp review? 
probably not. So it's all good. We really recommend that. It was a lot of fun. It was really yummy. Service great. Everything great. We don't get drinks, as you probably saw on the receipt. Um, we just got water and Coke. So our drinks were cheap. I don't know what the drink prices were like there. Ugh, pothole. But um, yeah, everything we got was really, really good. Since we were out the way that we drove, a little bit far from home, we were in here at Trader Joe's. So. Of course I had to go in. We never go to Trader Joe's. I think I've only been in Georgia with my friend Natalie. Um, obviously I need to get everything but the bagel seasoning. Comment down below, what are some stuff, what are some stuff, what are some things that I should get from Trader Joe's? Obviously not this time, but the next time we're out this way, um, my friend gave me a list of things, but I just don't know. I feel like I'm like not in the world of Trader Joe's shopping. in the car I didn't get that much we only spent like 10 minutes in there I'd say um, but I just got a few things uh, a couple things that I could get anywhere some bananas which I don't really eat bananas that much but I recently followed that girl on TikTok and Instagram happy healthy Haley and she shows like healthy meals and one of her healthy breakfasts is like a rice cake peanut butter bananas coconut flakes and um, sugar-free chocolate chips but I don't have the coconut flakes or chocolate chips Anyway, um, I also got plums, and then I got this watermelon jerky just because it seemed interesting. Watermelon is my favorite fruit. I love watermelon so much, but these look like they might be kind of weird. I don't know, we'll see. I'm always down to try something, but. Um, and then I got this seasoning. Of course, I had to get this. This is like the thing. Oh, it's all sealed up, but this is literally like all you hear about when people talk about Trader Joe's and it's all over like every recipe people use that on everything and then this was one of the things that my friend Natalie said to get cauliflower I don't know how you say it but I think you say it nochi maybe um, cauliflower nochi and it's frozen um, yeah so fun little haul not too many things something to just you know try out Trader Joe's and get a feel for it that place like I feel like it's underwhelming like I feel like it's not like full do you feel like that it's, it's not packed the same way like a, a, a normal stop grocery store right or, uh, like it's very like minimal and the aisles are right, very, wide very wide and yeah but anyway it was a fun little experience we never get to go there so try those things out and if there's other stuff that you guys recommend let me know and I'll try it next time